Hi guys, we're back here with Susan Campbell Renault, and she's talking about uh, Santa socks. Santa socks! And what are the socks for particularly? <laughs> we are doing a distribution of 750 Santa socks to a variety of veterans of all ages. We are going all over Missoula and Valley County, and what we're doing is dis distributing a real pair of socks. This is actually a pair of socks. And in it are... <laughs> a sock within a sock? A sock. Well, it's a real sock. <laughs> and we have treats, um, all kinds of lotions. And we have a love note. <laughs> and we have candy. And we have a toy soldier. And a bunch of other stuff that's inside the the um, the Santa socks. And what we're doing is just thanking our veterans for their service. We go to nursing homes. We go to homeless shelters. We go to private homes. We go to businesses. Um, if I'm in the post office and I have a Santa sock, I will randomly go up to someone that's a veteran and say, Merry Christmas, and just shock the <laughs> pants off of them. And it's like the first thing It's they, so they, much fun. Well, because they, you always think that, you know, stocking stuffers and all I that know, stuff. I know. But you like, you make it after actual socks. Oh. And I always think to myself, it's like, is this have everything to do with, like, um, World War One? you know, the trench, and you like, always keeping your socks. Trading nah, socks, keeping your no. feet it's dry. just it's a real pair of socks, and um, thanks to our sponsors, uh, once again we have a laundry list of sponsors. I don't know if we have time to even begin to read them. It's all on this little sheet of paper. <laughs> It's a, a long list. Oh wow. oh, wow, that is a long list. It's a There's long, a lot of a, you know, it's a long list. You have to check it and check it twice. Yeah, I mean, I just want to, you know, thanks to all the people who uh, go and support the veterans, you know, and it's a, a, a great way. And, this, and people can get in contact with you if they uh, think they, uh, they, if they know any veterans or, you're, you know, you're always looking for people. And, yes. you know, you're on the prowl for veterans yep. to try to give them some socks and some um, thank yous for yes. the season. We are doing this right now. You have caught me in the middle of Santa sock distribution. I am actually a magical elf. <laughs> I am Santa baby. I am not Susan Campbell Rennell. I am Santa Baby. And we are, in addition to giving out socks this year, thanks to Martha's Ministries and Wraps for Vets, we have gorgeous hats and magnificent. I brought up one of the blankets. Uh, we have beautiful blankets. Oh, wow. This is so beautiful. Wow. That it's really well done. Gorgeous. Yeah. yeah, these are works of art that we are giving to mostly veterans that are in nursing homes that need extra warmth yeah. that are always cold. Um, but the Santa socks are not just for people that are sick. It's for, like, for instance, um, tonight... I am going to deliver Santa socks to VFW Post 209 in commemoration for all the work that they do for veterans and um, to the Honor Guard. They're doing a funeral tomorrow at the Western Montana State Veterans Cemetery, and I'm going to be giving Santa socks to the Honor and Color Guard of the American Legion and the VFW. So it's for vital, robust veterans as well as veterans that are not feeling nice. as good yeah. and um, we are always looking for magical elves you <laughs> could be one hmm. I could recruit you. Um, we are doing this through December 25th. Yep all the way until Christmas. And I am doing it um, all over the all the nursing homes are going to be done this weekend the 14th through the 17th. And so it's vital that we get some magical elves. It's a very complicated schedule. It really right. is. Um, in fact, we were making minor adjustments to it just a minute ago via text. <laughs> I'm a high tech yep. Santa. And speaking Santa of uh, high tech, people can get in contact with you. Yes, uh, email, email, or email or text. Email or text. Email or text. So if you want to give a plug for people who yes. think that uh, maybe. Uh, there are some folks that are being overlooked this winter time. So yes, we would love to visit them. Um, we have limited. We need. We we do need elves. Yep. So if you are the the mother, the daughter, the son of of a veteran, 
or a, or a father of a veteran, and you could take a Santa sock and deliver it to a veteran, that yeah, I would dub you a magical elf. And my email, okay, everybody get out your pencil and paper, Blue Mountain, all one word, lowercase spelled out, Blue Mountain at Montana.com. Yep. And for texting or calling, mm -hmm. um, the North Pole phone number, this is the North Pole phone yep. number, is 719 661. Four zero three seven, and that goes right to the North Pole. Yep, and I have inside scoop on Santa Claus. Yep, and it, it, you'll be talking to an elf. You will. Directly. You might even talk to Santa Claus. What? What? Yeah. Okay. What? So once again, what is that number? Seven one nine six six one four zero three seven. Awesome. And Santa socks was started by veterans to honor veterans and some of the most amazing experiences have been when we have presented what basically is a simple pair of socks and veterans have said to us this is more important to us than the medals that we've received in combat because it was given oh and i have to mention i forgot <laughs> um school children this year have made hundreds of beautiful cards oh. and the little cards and I brought them with me and I forgot to show them to you but these are cards from Washington Middle School and Russell Elementary and a friend of mine by the name of Tanya and her grandchildren and another little group of family people have made fabulous cards so we have hundreds of cards that we're giving out to people too oh. so we will you might run into some <laughs> a magical elf who will randomly come up to you and say, Merry Christmas! Yep. It's fun. And you should look forward to it. And say, okay. Awesome. I mean, <laughs> at, uh, I gave a Santa sock to a gentleman at Tyrama yesterday, and it was so cute. He was with a younger man, and, and I said, Merry Christmas. This is, I'm Santa baby, this is a Santa sock. And he goes, oh, I'm not deserving. I said, yes, you are. <laughs> <laughs> so if you get a Santa sock, accept it. Yep. Awesome. Well, thank you, Susan, for all the work that you're doing and that the continued work that you do for veterans here out of Missoula and beyond. We it. Well, we love it. And it's fun. And so I hope you have a wonderful Merry yeah. Christmas. And uh, I hope all of your listeners and all of your viewers have a blessed Merry Christmas and a Happy Hanukkah. My, um, my godfather was Jewish. And believe it or not, I'm Presbyterian. My husband's Catholic. We're very <laughs> ecumenical. And um, it's a wonderful time of year, but it is also a very lonely time of year. So if you are lonely, please call me or email me, and we'll, we'll get a Santa sock to you if you're a veteran. Awesome. Well, thank you, Susan. Thank you. We'll be right back right after this. All right. <laughs>